gives you a little bit of inspiration to tackle that project or tackle that task. We need to kind of figure out a new system, especially for things like my blow dryer. It's a little bit of a mess. Echo, welcome into my bathroom. <laughs> Today we are tackling a project that I have had on my to-do list for around the house for months and months, months and months. I have been kind of stockpiling a few fun gadgets that we're gonna install today. So let me give you a quick view <laughs> of what this looks like right now and remember, this is a no judgment zone here. So let me show you uh, the before. First of all, this situation, I am definitely going to have to figure it out. Rob's side for the most part stays pretty clean. Mine, not so much. We have clutter everywhere. As long as it's not on the floor, we are good. But we need to kind of figure out a new system, especially for things like my blow dryer, stuff like that, my hair product, yeah. All of that we need to situate in here. Now, it has been a hot minute <laughs> since I have de-junked, decluttered, and organized up this space. What kind of brought this to a head for me was this area right here, because I was getting ready to head on an airplane and I could not find all the things I needed because this looks like that. But don't worry, we're going to clean all this stuff out. We're gonna make sure that I de-junk, look at all the expiration dates, things that we may or may not still need, things that I don't even use anymore. First, we're going to declutter and de-junk. We need to figure out what I'm gonna keep, what I'm going to rehome and what just needs to be thrown away and then we need to refold resituate clearly i can't even reach up there <laughs> that's why the, the towels look like that but we'll refold everything and yeah let's get to it i have different bins here that we're gonna use but i also have all of these bins over here too and even more here in the laundry room. So I don't know if I'm going to use these, they're here. Like I said, I feel like I have been preparing for this organization, de-junk, declutter, refresh <laughs> for months now. And so I have been just kind of holding on to things. Now, all of the bins that I am not using for the closet, I will use around the house in other places. Let's jump in. Now this is a very tight spot. There isn't a whole lot of space here for me to work. I will do my best and film as much of it as I can for you so I can just bring you along with me and hopefully give you some motivation <laughs> if you have a space that maybe looks like this so that you can get it taken care of as well. Now here is where <laughs> I have been keeping all of my blow dryer type things all down here. We need to absolutely de-junk this and I wanna clear this out completely. I have these bins right here and then I have this one. So these are stacked, but they won't be stacked like that. I'll have one of these with the drawer and then one of these right on top of it. And what I want to do is put all of like my hair stuff in one so that when I do my hair, all I have to do is just reach for this and bring this out of the closet, put it on my countertop, do my hair and then put it right back. That's my, that's my goal. And then in these right here, a lot of like my travel size bags, things like that, we can get organized into those other bins with the drawers. And then I have, a, I have pretty good organization already in here, but it's cluttered up. There's too much that needs to be probably consolidated, thrown away, like 
all the things. <laughs> so the other reason that I need to do this is because even like my Rodan and Fields, I am a Rodan and Fields girl. I love their products. Redefine is the line that I use, but I don't even know what exactly I have back here. And I need to figure that out because this is a lot of money sitting right here. So I just want to reorganize everything and make it so that I can see everything really, really well. But oh, this is gonna feel really good <laughs> when it's done. Here is where I've got everything just set up. And what I'm gonna do is just go through, obviously, garbage in here, what I'm gonna keep in here, or just put back in here. But I'm just gonna go through all of this stuff, kind of organize it into trash, uh, what I'm gonna keep, and what I'm gonna put in something that somebody else might want at some point. So. That's kind of how, that's the process that I'm going to use. And we'll just do that for the remainder of the shelves. We are messy here, <laughs> for sure. But you know what? We are making such good progress. So this is where we're at here. I have space here. I have an idea of what I wanna do with makeup stuff, but I'm just kinda trying to figure out what I need, what room I have. I'm gonna do this next, these two here. But I am so excited because this is all organized, all of my Rodan and Fields. This is all of just, uh, you can see, it's organized and it makes me so happy. And we have space for other things. So let's get to cleaning these two right here and then we're almost done.
It's a little bit of a mess, <laughs> but we are making amazing progress. I just need to get all of that. These are like travel toiletry things into here. And then all of our just extra toiletry type things. I need to decide on a bin and they'll go right here. But that's all down there. Those toiletries will go here. I've already put my blow dryer. This is like my everyday stuff right here. But it looks amazing. And then I do want to get another one of these to put on top to stack like this for down here. And I'm going to put my Lashify lashes there. And then all my nail stuff and my Lashify lashes and it'll be perfect. thinking like divider type things for the closet or like where the towels are but I'm not really seeing what I need here see kind of like I feel like I have these at home something similar that would do something like that hmm. kind of like this I think I feel like I have this I'm gonna hold off on this so this is kind of what I'm looking for but smaller than that why does that say small <laughs> This was the last piece to go in. Yes. Oh, wait. This is currently how I store my lashes. And what I wanted to do was put this in here into these, but I need this tray. So let me think. The good news is that these come apart, so I'm hoping that there'll be room on top of that. I wanna see if two will fit. Yes! All right, guys, in full transparency, <laughs> It is a couple of weeks later, but I want to tell you, I absolutely love the way this closet turned out. And it has infused a little bit of happiness in my morning routine, my evening routine, when I get out of the shower. It is amazing. So let me take you inside. that this is dejunked and decluttered. Yes, it looks like there's a whole lot of stuff in here, but truly everything that's in here is either used or will be used. But all of my makeup stuff is up here. All of the extra things that I 
either don't use often because the stuff that I do use often, I actually have right in here. So a lot of what I have here is when I want like glam and full face makeup. And then in the evening and in the morning, all I have to do is grab this tray right here and stick it on my countertop. All of my face care, all of that stuff is right here. I've got my deodorant here, so in the mornings after I shower, all I have to do is come in here and grab that. Everything is just organized and bunched up to where I can access everything really easily. All of our medications, vitamins, all the things are right here. And then one of my favorite things, so this is all stock of just extra things that we have. Rodan and Fields is my favorite. That's my go-to. The Redefine line is what I use for basically everything. And then this is my favorite part right here. And it's because this is all of my Dazzle Dry Nail Polish Mani Petty Kit. All I have to do is grab this and take it to wherever I want to give myself a manicure or pedicure. Um, if you don't know about Dazzle Dry and you like to paint your own nails like I do, Dazzle Dry is amazing. Hands down, best nail polish, lasts for weeks if you want. It's awesome. So anyways, then up here I have all of my Lashify stuff. So all of my glues, adhesives, all of the little pieces that I need for that. I have all of my extra lashes up here. And again, when I need to put on a fresh set of lashes, I just grab this and then I just grab this and we are good to go. All of our extra lotions, sunscreen, things like that are in this basket right here. And I think it just looks pretty. And then all of our extra soaps. We've got this Epsom bath salt. It's lavender uh, scented. It smells so good. Like, oh, I just absolutely love it. Just a couple of capfuls in a warm bath does wonders for achy muscles. And then we just have a few more extra things in here. This is all of my hair stuff whenever I need to do my hair. It's got my Dyson dryer in here. My diffuser is in there. We've got our wet dry brush here. And then these are the products that I use on my hair. Inner Sense is my go-to. And then in here is all of my extra hair products as I need things, like when I do straight hair like I actually have right now. This is the straightening cream here. So that is, this is all my hair stuff in this and this. So when I do my hair, all I have to do is pull this bin right out. You can see I can lift it up and I just stick it right here on the countertop. And when I'm done, I just put it right back. It has been a game changer at keeping my countertop nice and tidy. Now what I have down here are just a bunch of extra things, travel bags, um, we've got extra Ziplocs, things like that, makeup pouches, all things that I didn't want to get rid of. I purged so much, but some of the stuff is I've had for such a long time and I didn't want to get rid of it. So I just stuck everything like that in here. So this is kind of like travel stuff. And then this is actually my travel accessories. We've got Kleenex back there. We've got a whole bunch of these little like travel containers for lotions and creams, stuff like that. So this is all my travel things. And then these two right here, depending on how I feel when I'm packing, I have two different travel bags. So I love this. All of these bins right here I got at Target. You can find them in the bin and organization basket area, but you can also find different sizes in the bath and um, like kitchen area. They also have just different sizing um, in other sections too. So if you're looking for plastic bins like this, at a really good price. I love the, oh, what are they called? It's the Bright Room line. That is what all of these plastic bins are. But these ones, the trays, things like this, these I got 
at the container store. I love the drawers and I love that they're stackable. So this one is a drawer, obviously, and then they have this clear bin that just has easy access so you could pull it out or just grab what you need um, that fits perfectly right on top of them. Now the goal was to be able to keep my countertop as clean as possible. Now this area, I took a bunch of the stuff that was on here and stuck it up there. So I'm gonna have to figure out what I wanna do with this area. For now, it just, it's kind of been a catch-all. <laughs> so we're just gonna leave it that way. Now this, I actually didn't do anything to it. I, I It's been years to be honest, since I have redone this drawer, but it doesn't need it. I love it exactly the way it is. I've got my big clips here. I've got my scrunchies here, hair clips and ties. Everything is still organized and I'm pretty good at keeping this fairly clean. Like I have not done any organization to this for a really long time because this just works for me. And then this under here, I added this here. Now, I, down the road, I almost don't even wanna say because I'm not sure <laughs> when we're gonna find time, but I do want to darken all of this cabinetry. And if I do, I would paint this black so that it doesn't like stand out so much, but either way, it's fine and it totally works and does its job holds all those brushes. And then right here, this is all of my like straight hair stuff. This is the blow dryer I use to straighten my hair. It's like a 30 or $40, like you can get it for 30 bucks if it's on sale at Target, but it's the Revlon um, brush blow dryer, my absolute favorite for straight hair. And then I've got all of my curling irons, flat irons, some extra brushes in there, just depending <laughs> on how badly my hair is tangled. Um, but these are pretty much the brushes that I use here. And then the ones that I have in that bin over there. And then again, just some extra blow dryer pieces here, some cases when I need to travel and I wanna take my blow dryers with me and protect them. That's what these are here. Love, love that everything is nice and organized. Now in here, I made this my, kind of my cleaner area. I added this here, it's just one of these little paper towel holders and I stuck it um, right back on here. It's like a 3M thing and it's been fine. So I've got paper towels in here, some extras down there, and then all my cleaning stuff is right here. So when I need to clean something, all I have to do is reach down, grab it, can wipe the countertops down really quickly. Love this organization. Listen, if you have a space in your house that you go to, you access daily, multiple times a day, even a couple times a week. And if it's in disarray and completely unorganized, I hope this gives you a little bit of inspiration to tackle that project or tackle that task. And even if you don't do all of it all at once, do chunk it out. Maybe one day, de-junk everything. Another day, you can start organizing things. Another day, you can shop for new bins that you'll need. So you don't have to do it all in one fell swoop, but I will tell you that when it is done, it feels so good. All right, guys, thanks so much for watching. I'll see you soon, bye.